right, guys, so if you saw my last video, you know that I had starter interference problems. Really, it wasn't starter interference, it was starter engagement problems. So, is what I did is I went to my drill press back there, I put an end mill in it, and it's got a little X, Y axis on it. I set the depth on it, and I milled out the starter, so that way I can push it up towards the engine block, which in turn engages it into the starter. Now, I milled off about 25 to 30 thou off of it. I, it's not a whole lot. I'm hoping it's enough to see if this starter will engage. I mean, because as of right now, the starter's no good to me, and it might save me some money. So I'll show you what that starter looks like. So that's what the starter looks like. Obviously, I can't do very straight lines, but it's now all one smooth, flat surface. So taking it off of here, see this surface meets the bottom of the block. Taking it off here is going to push it up, which is going to allow it to engage because as you all know, the flywheel, or the flex plate, runs right through there and up. So if you push it up, it's going to engage more into those teeth. So the only thing i got to do now is go ahead and throw it in the truck and see what happens. Alright, let's see if my makeshift uh, starter works. Ooh, it does. It's cranking over. Now I kind of want to get it fired up. I got my number one helper in there. M Michelin man himself. I'm having him turn the key on. He doesn't understand what's going on, but Mama does. Hi, bud! Well, I shut it off because I ended up breaking early because of that water temp gauge right there. It went a little hot to me. I can't tell you how excited I am to take this thing to the track and whoop on all you boys that are talking smack. Hey, if you haven't yet, subscribe so that way you can catch my first event at the track. It's coming soon, hopefully, and uh, see what I do with this thing. Remember, 4.3 with the 4-speed uh, 4L60E transmission and went 16.9 in the quarter mile. This thing sounds pretty rowdy. I think I ought to be able to increase it get a lot quicker time out of it shooting for 1250 if I got anything close with that with these tires that are on it I'd be happy but I imagine it'd probably be like a 13 8 14 second quarter mile can't leave but 
thanks to all of you that have subscribed. I appreciate it, and you all have a great night.